Recently, astrophotographer Satoru Murata achieved what many consider the most scientifically valuable image of 3i Atlas to date. Working from New Mexico with a 0.2 meter telescope, he combined 24 separate 60 second exposures using advanced sigma clipping techniques to produce an image with extraordinary detail and clarity. What this image revealed has fundamentally changed our understanding of this object's behavior. The tail extends for 2.6 million kilometers. That's not just impressive, that's seven times the distance between Earth and the Moon. To put that in perspective, if you could drive a car at highway speeds non-stop, it would take you over three years to travel the length of this tail. But the sheer length isn't what has scientists most excited and puzzled, it's the structure. This tail maintains an incredibly narrow, well-defined column for its entire extraordinary length. In normal cometary physics, we expect particle tails to spread out and diffuse as they extend away from the nucleus. Large particles should follow ballistic trajectories and spread into a broad cone. Small particles should be pushed by solar radiation pressure into wide, fan-shaped structures. Instead, 3i Atlas particles appear to follow what can only be described as a highway in space, maintaining tight formation and precise alignment for millions of kilometers. This suggests either an extremely uniform particle size distribution, which would be highly unusual, or some kind of organizing force that keeps particles in formation far longer than conventional physics would predict. The image also reveals multiple simultaneous jet structures pointing in completely opposite directions, some directed toward the sun, others pointing away from it. This bidirectional outgassing creates a complex, almost symmetrical pattern that suggests highly organized internal structure and gas flow dynamics. Perhaps most intriguingly, the image shows what's called an anti-tail, a structure that appears to point toward the sun created when Earth crosses the plane of the comet's orbit and we see large particles reflecting sunlight from the orbital plane. Anti-tails are normal phenomena, but they typically last for only brief periods when viewing geometry is just right. The 3i Atlas anti-tail has remained sharp and well-defined far beyond the typical time frame, suggesting either unusually large particle emissions or highly directional release mechanisms. Faced with this unprecedented collection of anomalies, the international scientific community has developed three primary theoretical frameworks to explain what we're observing. Theory 1. The Extreme Natural Explanation This hypothesis suggests that 3i Atlas represents an extreme example of natural cometary physics, but operating within known scientific principles. Under this model, the comet's nucleus contains an unusual concentration of highly volatile ices, specifically carbon monoxide and molecular nitrogen, that sublimate at much lower temperatures than water ice. This could explain the sustained outgassing, as these exotic ices would continue releasing gas even at the greater distances from the sun, where water-based comets become inactive. The stable rotation might result from an unusually dense, structurally rigid nucleus that resists the torques generated by outgassing. The reflective patches could represent areas where these volatile ices are exposed at the surface, creating naturally reflective regions. The rhythmic cyanogen bursts might emerge from deep internal fractures or vents that become active only when specific regions rotate into direct sunlight, creating a natural timing mechanism. While this would make 3i Atlas an extremely unusual comet, it would still operate within the boundaries of known physics and chemistry. Theory 2. Observational and Geometric Effects Some researchers propose that many of the apparent anomalies might result from the specific geometry of our observations and the limitations of our measurement techniques. The angle between Earth, the comet's orbit, and the Sun creates a unique viewing perspective that might make certain structures appear more organized or stable than they actually are. The apparent stability in thrust measurements might reflect the sensitivity limits of our detection methods. Small variations might exist, but fall below our measurement threshold. The periodic behaviors might appear more synchronized than they really are because our data comes from discrete observation sessions rather than continuous monitoring. Under this explanation, 3i Atlas might be more normal than it appears, with the anomalies being artifacts of how and when we're observing it rather than genuine physical peculiarities. Theory 3. Unknown Physical Processes This is the most speculative but scientifically honest hypothesis. 
Some researchers are considering whether the behavior patterns are so consistently organized and stable that they might indicate physical processes or material properties that our current understanding of cometary science doesn't adequately explain. This doesn't necessarily imply anything artificial or engineered, but rather suggests that interstellar objects might operate under physical conditions or material compositions so different from solar system objects that they require new theoretical frameworks. Perhaps the extreme cold of interstellar space, the different radiation environments, or the unique formation conditions in other stellar systems create material properties we've never encountered before. This hypothesis encourages scientists to remain open to the possibility that our models of cometary behavior developed from studying objects formed in our own solar system might not fully apply to visitors from radically different stellar environments. December 19th represents a pivotal moment in this scientific investigation, the date when 3i Atlas will make its closest approach to Earth. This event has mobilized observatories across the globe, from ground-based telescopes to space-based instruments, all coordinating to gather the most comprehensive data set ever collected on an interstellar object. The key measurements will focus on particle velocity analysis. If the cyanogen jets show velocities in the range of hundreds of meters per second, this would strongly support natural sublimation explanations. However, if velocities reach into the kilometers per second range, it would require scientists to develop entirely new models for gas release mechanisms in cometary nuclei. Advanced spectroscopic analysis will reveal the precise chemical composition of the jets, potentially identifying exotic compounds or unusual isotopic ratios that could provide clues about the object's formation environment. High-resolution imaging campaigns will track how the mysterious bright patches evolve over time, whether they change, fade, or remain constant. Perhaps most importantly, researchers will determine whether the impossible thrust stability continues beyond the current 182-day record. Extended monitoring will also reveal whether the precision rotation remains stable or begins showing the wobbling and precession that physics predicts should eventually occur. Simultaneous observations from multiple locations will provide parallax measurements that could reveal three-dimensional structure in the tail and jet formations, potentially explaining how particles maintain such tight formation over such vast distances. 3i Atlas represents only the third confirmed interstellar visitor we've been able to study in detail, but it's already demonstrating that these cosmic travelers are far more diverse and scientifically valuable than we initially imagined. Oumuamua! Our first interstellar visitor confused scientists with its mysterious acceleration and unusual elongated shape. Two, I Borisov appeared more conventionally comet-like, but revealed chemical signatures that differed subtly from solar system comets. Now, 3I Atlas is presenting a completely new category of anomalies that challenge fundamental assumptions about cometary physics. Each interstellar visitor is essentially a sample from another stellar system, a direct physical specimen that carries information about formation conditions, chemical compositions, and physical processes that occurred around other stars. These objects are natural space probes that traveled for millions or billions of years to bring us information we could never obtain any other way. The anomalies we're observing in 3i Atlas are teaching us that the diversity of objects in the galaxy may be vastly greater than we've assumed based on studying only our own solar system. Different stellar environments, different formation temperatures, different radiation fields, and different chemical abundances could create objects with properties we've never encountered. Whether the final explanation proves to be exotic, natural physics, observational effects, or something that requires new theoretical frameworks. Three, I, Atlas, is already expanding our understanding of what's possible in the universe. It's forcing scientists to question assumptions, develop new measurement techniques, and consider theoretical possibilities that seemed unnecessary just months ago. Three, I, Atlas, isn't just another unusual space object. It's a cosmic laboratory that's actively testing the limits and boundaries of our current understanding of physics, chemistry, and planetary science. Every measurement we take, every image we capture, every spectrum we analyze is providing data that will influence scientific thinking for years to come. In the coming weeks, as this interstellar visitor reaches its closest approach, we're going to witness one of the most intensive scientific observation campaigns in astronomical history. 
The data collected will either confirm that we're dealing with extreme but natural physics, or it will open entirely new chapters in our understanding of how matter behaves under conditions we've never studied before. What makes this story even more compelling is that it's happening in real time. We're not studying ancient light from distant galaxies or theoretical models of exotic physics. We're observing an actual object right here in our solar system that's demonstrating behaviors that challenge our most fundamental assumptions about how the universe works. What do you think we're really looking at here? Are we witnessing the most extreme example of natural cometary physics ever discovered, or is 3i Atlas showing us that objects from other stellar systems can behave in ways we've never imagined possible? The beauty of science is that we don't have to guess. We're about to get answers. Leave your theories and predictions in the comments below. And if you want to follow every development in this story that's literally rewriting astronomical textbooks as we watch, make sure to like this video, share it with fellow space enthusiasts, and subscribe to the channel for the latest updates. The universe continues to surprise us with mysteries we never expected, and we'll be here to explore every fascinating discovery together.